I'm very much a country person, so I relate to country living, particularly to being around the water. This U designer home at the lakes has been created by Jay Jagger. I really enjoyed the idea of the community around the lakeside and I, I felt it was important to make something that was going to be comfortable throughout all the different sort of weathers that we get in England and I think keeping that in mind, you know, even on a rainy day when I think it's still kind of wonderful to be out, you know, breathing fresh air, to keep the auger and to keep a sort of proper family kitchen, a fireplace and generally sort of keep a kind of homey affair. So. That was, that was my approach to it. Obviously, having a family like, inclined me towards that. I don't necessarily think that the lakes is, is just about families. I think it's an incredibly romantic view. It's sort of like being in the tropics somewhere, so any time that you're kind of right over the water. So I think that it's great for, for couples and, and obviously has a, a community that will incorporate everything. I wanted to make double height space here so we could fully enjoy the beautiful view because one of the most amazing things about living on the lakes is of course being by the water which is a magical combination of being in the depths of the English countryside and having this almost tropical view out onto the lakes. So this is our living room which I've cut into a couple of different spaces. So although it's open plan it's also quite cosy because right at the far end there we've got a fireplace and a sort of snuggier area with a bar behind one of the cupboards and another hidden TV. Yeah I just wanted to have this kind of central area as the theatre, the sort of the grand entrance of the whole house and so we've got um, the dining room kind of floating underneath that with the, the most pivotal view. And then I'd like to take you into my kitchen, one of my favourite areas in the home, where I decided to go quite cosy because for me I think that the lakes isn't just about the summer but also about coming down to enjoy some of the uh, warmer, darker, more Christmassy times. So we put in this fabulous arga but I wanted to set it back with something a little bit more modern so we, we put it with a black kitchen. And so you can either have the kitchen open onto your living area or closed away so that when you're here on your own in your slippers, I would be snuggling up with a nice cup of tea or perhaps some brandy. So coming through here, there's lots of different areas off the central living room. We made this snug or kind of play room. Um, Again, one of my favourites, something that I've got in my own home and I uh, really just wanted to share with everybody because we all just enjoyed sitting around here, it's so intimate and just watching a couple of videos or a bit of TV, playing a bit of Scrabble and I just think it's really nice to have these little intimate places so that you don't feel like you're rattling around. It's a four bedroom house, this uh, Jade at the Lakes and one of the bedrooms is down here, this is it the guest bedroom, I guess, or of course, you know, you can sleep in here yourself if you prefer to be all on one level. I think the great thing about these um, homes is that they're so adaptable and I think that they can really provide a great home for couples or families. Upstairs, we've got three bedrooms. I'm gonna take you through to the master bedroom. Again in the master bedroom we took advantage of the incredible views, so not only are you lying there being able to look out, um, we've also made the bathroom sort of semi open plan so that from the bath you can lie back in the lap of luxury and look out onto this incredible view. I went for these kind of tones of purple because I just always think that they make me feel sort of warm and cosy but in the bathroom we were just a bit more urban and light and chic. So like I said, you can either have the doors 
open or you can close them up for a little bit more privacy. But I think really what an incredible aspect. I think really exciting and again giving you such a sort of nice holiday feeling even if you're staying here all the time. With the double height ceiling you get again another great view from the top. You can look down, see what your family are doing, look out, take a breath, take a moment and just really enjoy being in the countryside. We've set it up so that there's a kids room and another bedroom but obviously we all adapt to our own lifestyles. They've even got a little study area outside or somewhere that you can paint, because I love to paint. Um, you know, again, just do a little bit of work because we can never quite get away, can we? Or of course for your kids to study. This is um, the second spare room. I love the black and pink, really one of my favorites. I think that just the shocking pink just gives such a great touch. And, um, you know, just simple, nice, clean lines, the bed, everything that you could need. We made a real family-sized bathroom here. I feel like everybody could get in. A nice big tub. And the mirrored back. Again, a bit of a glossy finish. So to my favourite place, the terrace where you really can soak up the lakes and really get such a fantastic view over this spectacular place. It really is incredible. 